Hey there, YouTube is I, True Stealth, with another Dandy Ace vid, and today we're going into Scizorella's Garden. This is the home of Scizorella, the new boss of this beta version. We already met with Axelangelo, and he was great and all. A nice little fight, but, but, Scizorella, she's a new challenge that's going to be very enjoyable to go up against. Uh, and of course, for a new challenge, we're gonna want some new cards. And so, what cards are we going to do? But, so we're gonna finish up fireworks, of course. Then we're gonna put the rest probably into cart recycle. And we have a little bit left over. Uh, don't really have anything particular I care about, but I guess I'll put it onto Sugar Dandy. Yeah, why not? Now this card right here, we're putting this on top of shooting stars. Because shooting stars, as nice as you are, you aren't exactly what I need. Yeah. And another interesting thing about this boss as well, so pff, now I get a card, funny shoes, is that this boss actually has a lot of minions with her. Yeah, so it's not gonna be just a 1v1 mono a mono, two men battling it out, but instead, it's gonna be me versus the garden and it's gonna be fun all right so and since i haven't showed this area off yet we're going to do the lore hmm. <laughs> i want to hear some lore well yes yes i do the great danny ace never ceases to amaze me well thanks it's always good to meet a fan a friend i'm just a friend Beyond this gate lies Cicerella's garden. Cicerella? Is that the name of the gardener? I like the sound of it. So melodic. She's the lady of ladies, the royal gardener of the ever-changing palace. She's not only extremely elegant, but every bit as powerful as well. Sounds like someone I'd love to meet. Is she friendly? Only to those she deems worthy. And she is known to be someone of an authoritarian. Not a problem. I'll use my most charming magic tricks. You're underestimating her. Don't say I never warned you. <laughs> yeah, so, and with that, we go into the garden. Now, this is going to be my first run in the garden, so I don't expect to win or anything, might will be nice. Stop right there. Stop right where you are, young man. You are causing permanent damage to my garden with every step you take. Oh, I didn't notice. I am so, so sorry. And he keeps walking in my direction. Preposterous. Would you like me to pair you some tea as well? Thanks. I have my own tea. Also, oh, forming has made me a little peckish, though. Do you have any crackers? You insolent brats. Lady Cicerella is going to teach you some manners. <laughs> Oof, that laugh. Uh-oh. Yeah, so, um... Yeah, so I'm not... <laughs> oh, God. Actually, wait. So this may have actually been like the run that I wanted to have with other cards on, but oh well, I guess. Wow, we are actually doing a lot of damage this range build. Oh wait, what? Oh, oh, oh my! I, I didn't expect that to happen. Uh, fortunately, I did at least remember to recover my stuff this round, so there's that. Plus, since I'm like doing a really heavy range build, I don't need to worry as much about. Oh, I mean, I, I need to worry about that if I'm being stupid. But I'm already at, she's already at half health. You know what that means? Half is easy. But oh, so breeze. Uh, except I'm half as stupid as she is. I say half as stupid because uh, <laughs> You can see her health is going down at the speed of sound. I'm not even sawing the hedgehog. Like, oh yeah, it's great. Woo! 
Oh, uh. Yeah, let's uh, just not. Yeah, so we're actually gonna just like do some gardening work real quick. Oh my gosh, these cards are so good. Wait, what am I doing? Yeah, I can just do that. Oh my gosh, these cards are so good. Wait, I'm, I'm so bad. Or am I? Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Pro level skills, pro level skills. Um, so they call her Scissorella, but I'm gonna call her easy to beat her because that's what she is. Three, two, one, GG. <laughs> Woo! That was a nice and quick boss fight. Uh, man. Hungry Chomper number one. So, uh, oh, I'll take us to the Crumpet. Poison Roses. Ooh, poison. That sounds nice. And, uh, Tier 7 Shrink Star. Wow. Unfortunately, this run, unfortunately, the beta version only goes up to the first boss. So we can't really make use of this amazing card. But, oh my god. Gosh, like imagine, like, there's there is you. I don't know where to put it. My hand right now is just so good. I don't have a reason to use it. Like look at this stuff. Actually, actually, I think about. It. I'll put it on shooting star, or I'll place five of a kind. Ooh, ooh, that's something beautiful. A thousand burn damage on top of massive. Explosions and range damage, like th th this right here is amazing. Yeah, we don't need five of kind. Oh my god! Like this is why I'm so excited for this game. The gameplay, it's great, it's fun, exciting. The bosses are very. I mean, we got some bosses which are more or less just melee bruisers that zone you out, like Axlanjo. Then you got other bosses like Cicerella here, who's actually. Sure, she's going to be melee at times, but when she goes range, she can cover so much stuff. And the boss fights on each, no matter the boss, it progressively gets better and more exciting as you play. And this is only the first bosses. These are only the first two bosses you can fight in the game. Like, these are both stage one bosses. I, I'm so excited and I really cannot wait until we get more. Uh, So, yeah. I'm going to show off Nymph real quick before I go off because we do so much stuff. And of course, of course, power start. So, <laughs> blown away. Uh, and since I'm, I'll lose any of my shards by keeping them anyway, I mm, I can't do Forge. or I really want to do Forge because if I could upgrade cards to Shopkeepers, I could literally keep the same card throughout the entire run and just be set. But that's only on very hard, and the demo only goes up to normal. So it's just another thing for us to look forward to in the in the final game. Uh, of course, at the very least, you want to get Arena Master and just like start working our way to that. So as you see over here, we cannot go in this game because it requires a green club's key. Ah, but ah, it's unfortunate. However. Demo is in great progress. It's doing amazing. And it's just a first demo build. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, then you should pick up this game. Like you can go to and pick up the uh, demo Raf Steam. And if you want a bit of a, some extra features, a bit more of a pro type build, I suggest checking out the Discord. Of course, both links are down below. And I hope you really enjoyed, because I sure did. Thanks for watching, and I'll see y'all again next time.